we will Google search MetaMask and click on the link leading to MetaMask.io. Click on the download button. Know that if you are on a different browser, then this link should automatically lead you to their respective MetaMask extension download page. Click on Add to Chrome. In the notification pop up, click on Add extension. This will take a few seconds. MetaMask extension has now been added to your browser. To create a new wallet, we will click on Create a Wallet. But if you already have a MetaMask wallet beforehand, then you can click on Import Wallet. Now enter your password and click on Create. Click on Next. Click on this blurry box and save your secret recovery phrase in a text file as you will be needing this in the coming step. Then click on Next. Now we will click on the words in a sequential order as they were in the secret key. Then click on Confirm. Now click on All Done. Now we will add the Polygon Scan Mainnet and Polygon Scan Testnet networks to our MetaMask extension. First, to add the Polygon Scan Mainnet, we will open our MetaMask extension, then click on the Networks drop down. Now click on Add Network. We will first add the Polygon Scan Mainnet settings. In your browser, search the following link that is being highlighted. Here you will find the Polygon Scan mainnet settings, which you will need to enter in the respective fields in the MetaMask. Now we will add the Polygon Scan Testnet network to our MetaMask extension. We have now added the Polygon Scan mainnet as well as the Polygon Scan Testnet to our MetaMask extension. We are now ready to log into NFT Box. Click on Connect. Select your wallet account from the list that you want to log in with and click on next. Now click on connect. You are now logged into NFT box. Now we will mint an NFT and list it for sale in the marketplace. We need to first create a collection. To do that, we click on our user icon and then click on My Collections. Then click on Create New Collection button. Enter your collection title. Enter your collection URL. Select a category.
Here we will add our collection logo. Then click on create collection. Now that we have a collection, we can proceed with minting our NFT into this collection. To mint your NFT, click on create your NFT. Here enter your NFT title. Enter your NFT description. Select your collection. Then select the available blockchain network. And then make sure that your MetaMask is also on the same network from the networks drop down in MetaMask. Then add your NFT image. Now click on create your NFT. You will then see a MetaMask window pop up. Click on the confirm button below. You have now successfully minted your NFT. As you can see the newly minted NFT is unverified so it cannot be listed for sale or transferred to any other user yet. To list the NFT for sale the admin must first verify your NFT via the admin panel. The admin must go to the NFT section then click on NFT list. In the status section double click on the pending button then click on verify to verify the NFT. The user will then see that their NFT has been verified. Now it can be listed for sale or transferred to another user. To list the NFT for sale, click on list for sale. Then choose whether you want to sell the NFT by auction or with a fixed price. To sell in an auction, the user must set a starting bid amount. Then set the bidding start date and the end date. Then click on apply. Finally, click on complete listing button. Then scroll down and click on confirm in MetaMask. The NFT is now listed for sale in auction. If the NFT is sold in auction, other users can see the starting bid price and the auction end timer in the NFT page. To bid on an NFT, the user must click on make offer and then enter an amount greater than the starting bid or the previous bidder. Then click on make offer. Then scroll down in MetaMask and click on confirm. All users can see the previous bid history as shown here. In the case where the user fails to win an auction, then their deposited amount can be used on any other NFTs listed for sale via auction in the marketplace. To list the NFT for sale with a fixed price, click on list for sale. Then switch to the fixed price section. Then enter the amount you want to sell for. Then click on the date you want to start selling the NFT and then click on the date you want to take the listing down on. Then click on apply. Click on complete listing to commit. Finally scroll down in the MetaMask pop-up and click on confirm. The NFT is now listed for sale. If the NFT is sold with a fixed price, to purchase the NFT, they can click on the Buy Now button. Then click on Checkout. And then click on Confirm. The NFT has been bought by the user.